All right, let's play this in full first. What is it you want, Mary? What do you want? You, you want the moon? Just say the word and I'll throw a lasso around it and pull it down. What is it you want, Mary? All right. <clears throat> So my impressions would be a that I like him, especially like the character. It's always cool to see this rig animated. I think generally, I have two questions for you. That would be one: What are your thoughts? What is it you want, Barry? What are your thoughts on this? Is just me. There's always kind of a thing that I'm looking for, but again, it's not. It's always a bit of a destructive note um, because it it. it asks for changes, like bigger changes. Suppose if I scrub through, right, the main thing I'm seeing is that the character is pretty much always here in his box. The biggest contrast is from going up here to being up straight here, right? So you got that contrast there. What if, and again, it's a big if, what if he would be standing and i know i can i can see eye rolls already but imagine standing it, it starts standing with with a, a turn into a sit down or if you start here what is it you want barry what do you want you you want the or maybe you start just globally moved over this way same poses and he is hunched over but maybe potentially even a bit more and a bit more three quarter to us to get a bigger c curve and what is it you want, Barry? And on this, he would be straight up because he's more tense. That's my awesome drawing, by the way. Three and a half years of art school, and <laughs> this is my result. I love it. Um, so imagine he's hunched over, and then because he's more tense, he's like, "What do you want?" I'm angry, and then what do you want? You and then as he gets a bit more relaxed here, what do you want? You you want the moon? You want the moon? Like use that to to have him then almost it's, it's a very complicated note here but almost lean over just say the word and i'll throw a lasso around it and pull it down i'll just throw a lasso and pull it down and then it, then it's more that he's kind of he's kind of like like that you know with his with his buckets i know it's tricky because then the bucket would be too far away but then i'm it's just something where you know where he's almost like that or the opposite. I mean, you know, just to throw out something even more confusing. What if he starts all relaxed this way? Maybe even one arm up or up one leg or maybe even both legs. What is and I'll move my tool here. Hold on. What is it you want, Barry? And you might be able to say that as he's here. What is it you want, Barry? What do you want? And then what do you want? Like just on that little quiet one, maybe maybe pushes himself up a bit more on that on that arm, right? And then maybe he can bring then one leg down the you must be on the phone here and i'm killing all of this here with the bucket but you you want the moon you want the moon and then you end up here just say the word and i'll throw a lasso around it and pull it down maybe that's maybe that's a thought because right now the, again just to go back he's mostly stuck in here and i'm trying to loosen it up where it might start here and here or with a you know standing sitting down into this it's just there's a bit more interesting contrast in the in the body poses moon just say the word and i'll throw a lasso around it and pull it down and it's almost like do we need this because you haven't it reinforces that he watches tv and probably has popcorn right we can see it at the end but it's such a thing at the end that is it if we lose it is it that much of a big deal there i think i think we could lose it if we sacrifice it for more contrasting poses what is it you and the second thing is you want the moon just say the word and i'll throw a lasso around it and pull it down so i'm assuming just say the word it's to me you have two things going on a he says the line just say the word and I'll and he's upset and like, ah, very dismissive. But at the same time, as he says this, it seems like he's also thinking about the TV and he just sees something that is now more important to him than the discussion. And it's, I don't know, I don't know if that's a bit conflicting right there. And then his expression and the smile seems, I don't hear that in the voice. And I'll throw a lasso around and pull it Well, maybe, I guess. Just say the word and I'll throw a lasso around and pull it down. 
I don't know, there's still more frustration in there that this seems a bit of a weird, a weird expression, doesn't quite match the tone to me. But I understand that he's not invested in that conversation anymore. And then does that. Um, it's a bit tricky. My main thing would be just to break up. Like I, the thing is, I like the poses. This is a, it's a nice pose. It's all clear. You got a color silhouette. All that stuff is cool. I like to lean over with the body. Like all that stuff is cool. I'm not saying it's bad. I'm just looking for ways to make this a bit more interesting. It seems just a bit simplified. Subjectively for me, a bit too simple where we could push the posing more to kind of A, reflect his mood a bit more, but again, give us a bit more contrast and, and complexity. Especially here, you got one thing going on in the leg. And it doesn't have to be that, you know, the character has to move all the time and everything has to be moving. This could be a completely valid shot. So that's why it's, to me, it's less of a note. It's more of a question. Are you okay with doing this? Are you willing to explore this? Or you do want to, or do you want to keep it like this and refine the animation based on what's there? Because again, in this, you know, for people that are listening, it's, I don't want to animate through the person here. Like I don't want to force my notes on there. This is all still their shots. And Fabio, this is your shot. So I don't want to dictate things. If that's what you want to do, I can help you with this. These are just my thoughts on that. It's all, you know, or you keep this and we're pushing the eating factor a bit more. But I want to hear your thoughts. Email me your thought process and ideas of what he sees. And if that's, if that's, if I'm reading this correctly, that this, because this would happen what because he suddenly hears something or there's some, maybe a bigger flash on a TV that, that catches his attention. And then, you know, it's such a big take too. Just say the word now. Say the word now. Say the word now. And I don't know if that it feels like. Say the word now. Is that not tied to the audio? Is that a delivery with that move based on the audio? Or is that a say the word a surprise take of what he's seen? Like with that his anticipation of hey, that's something cool on TV. Which again could be slightly conflicting. Anyway, I feel like I'm rambling. So instead of giving you um, you know, crazy crazy notes on you know in terms of animation i do want to clarify some things in terms of just broader uh poses and ideas so i'm going to leave it at that and you can let me know through email and we can continue all right thank you all right there's an email you can sign up you can start whenever you want you can submit whatever you want you get 16 submissions either way a like and subscribe would be awesome all right thank you